wouldn't open. We'd better go back. I can do this. It just needs a little more oomph. Here, use this baseball bat. That's me, peg like your cannonball. Now stand aside. I'll get us out of here. That won't be necessary. Look, sparkly dust. It's so pretty. <laughs> I'd have had us in ship shape long ago. <laughs> more like shipwrecked. <laughs> Come back here, you fight like a paperback! Look, it's Richard! Cute little bugger. Do we have to wake him up? He's our only hope! Well then, let's get to it. Time's a wasting, you landlubbers! Old times are wasting, all right. Just hold on to your doubloons. I haven't finished yet. Land ho! All hands on deck! Avast, your mateys! Huh? Fantasy? Adventure? What are you doing here? Me too. I'm here too. Furl your sails, you slobbering sea dog. The boy's not blind. Richard, something's wrong at the library. Sanctuary, sanctuary. He means there's been a mutiny. Hard covers mixed with paperbacks. I found books on Needlepoint next to Captain's Courageous. Can't this wait until morning? It's cold and flu season. No, this can't wait. We need your help. Now, are you coming? Wow, cool. What are they? <gasps> They're books. Aren't they classics? I thought you said something was weird. Jeez, you guys woke me up for nothing. Don't go, Master. Don't go. It is weird. Really, it is. We really do need your help. Humph! allowed to read the page master's secrets you'll destroy everything quite right and then the two of us shall rule the written world the two of us honey don't ask yes the two of us dr jekyll Definitely not good. Did you know that 3% of accidents occur in poorly lighted areas? Accidents? Honey, if we don't get that book back from Hyde, we're all going to be obituaries. I don't understand. Lad, that book is the page master. His power gives us meaning, definition. Without him, we books are doomed. Oh, I'm too young to die. Please, Master, please save us. If we books die, there'll be no more dreams, no more imagination, no more anything. You've got to find Hyde. Yeah, but where exactly do I find him? What, do I look like a tour guide? From here on out, it's all up to you, honey. Hyde! Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde is a book!
deep and see the smell of adventure. I wish I had permission to come aboard with you. Phew. Smells more like a bad tuna sandwich to me. Does it always go like this? Fare thee well, matey. Remember, a captain always goes down with his ship. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's very positive. Ever thought about a career in psychology? Don't forget, Master. Books are your friends. Ocean, why didn't I bring my drama mean? Look out for Jolly and Roger! He's in a really bad mood! <laughs> Now this doubloon was of the purest virgin gold. You've been messing in the wrong place at the wrong time. Yaman, yeah, you don't even have the well doubloon. I think I'll take the path of least resistance. I will have no man in my boat, said Starbuck. Who is not afraid of a whale? By this, he seemed to mean not only that the most reliable and useful courage was that which arises from the fair estimation of peril, but that an utterly fearless man is far more dangerous than a coward. Enough! Enough! I've read that. That's a good book. Get the boy! boy! Get the boy! I had to find some new way of escape. There's nobody here. There's a face only a monster could love. Yeah.
And there's the cemetery. Cemetery, he must have meant. Bananas are an excellent source of potassium. His pure tight skin was an excellent fit, and closely wrapped up in it, and embalmed with inner strength, like a revivified Egyptian. or the science of whales. Must not at last be exterminated from the waters, and the last whale, like the last man, smoke his last pipe and then himself evaporate in the final puff. it is. This is my century off. I'm very sorry. Where's your sunscreen? For crying out loud, this is the desert. You could fry an egg out here. I'm looking for a whale. Go west and north to the oasis. It's the only water I know of. Now, if you don't mind, I could use a few thousand more years sleep. Uh, did you say Oasis? An irresistible argument would seem furnished to show that the hunted whale cannot now escape speedy extinction. his birth and Aladdin's lamp.
courage was one of the great staple outfits of the ship. Like her beef and her bread, and not to be foolishly wasted. What you take for the white whale's malice is only his awkwardness, for he never means to swallow a single limb. Since that almost fatal encounter, Ahab had cherished a wild vindictiveness against the whale. Have you seen it? No, no white whales today. Uh, but I did see a water spout earlier. Uh, over there, I think. Ahab's looking for you. You gotta get out of here. He'll be back any minute. Go on, get out of here. Oh, she blows! A hump like a snow hill. It's Moby Dick. I, I, hearty, that monstrous fish reaped away me leg. I grin at thee, thou grinning whale. Stand aside, boy. No! You're trying to hurt him! I told you, this is between me and that demon. Now, stand aside! I won't let you! I will tolerate no more stalling! This is your last chance! Stand aside! You'll have to kill me first! So be it! <laughs> <laughs> Did you fetch me to the blue man? Yaman, dog master, he let you pass free of charge. <laughs> a large, airy place, and in a far corner I beheld great heaps of coin and bars of gold. Wow! A treasure map! Should I take the last one? Touch one hair on that boy 
his head, and you'll be answering to me. Looks like your friend ain't worth the soft boy. You be coming with us to Treasure Island. Let me go! Let me go! Welcome aboard, matey. Long John Silver. My lad, the very same. I... I really have to go. I'm trying to find... Ye wouldn't happen to be going after me treasure now, would ye? I'm missing me map. Do you have it? Hmm. Ah, Richard Tyler. We'll be rich together. Land ho! Land ho! Treasures west by a tree. The treasure. the treasure! Me first. Open it! Get out of my way! Look at all the treasure! You only get one choice, Richard Tyler. Make it a good one. Yes! I got the golden shears! I chose the right treasure! A fine choice, lad! Good luck on your adventure! Fifteen men on a dead man's chest! Yo ho ho and a bottle of rum! Careful, Master. It's scary down there. Good luck, honey. You are a red sky at night, sailors delight them. No red sky at dark, no wait. No. Red sky? What about a brody green one? If he be Mr. Hyde, I shall be Mr. Seek. Why didn't I bring my flashlight? Nowhere was there any trace of Henry Jekyll, dead or alive.
kitty, kitty, kitty. Good job, master. Open it! <laughs> Open it! I stole through the corridors, a stranger in my own house, and coming to my room saw for the first time the appearance of Edward Hyde. It was mutton, was it breath? It was a T-bone, bird brain. Mutton! It was a T-bone, I tell you, you... Hello, what have we here? Lovely night for a stroll, isn't it, my tasty little hors d'oeuvre? You're in mortal danger! Would you care for some assistance? No thanks. I've got to find the page master. Dangerous parts, these. Looks like you could use some help. No way! Fantasy said I had to find Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde on my own. Ixnay on the Eckle J. Ixnay on. Don't listen to this, Dodo! Jekyll lives in the mansion atop the hill. Nice going, bird brain. And it was mutton. It was beef, I tell you. Hey. Yes! I made it! Horror, what's wrong? Oh, I don't feel too good, master. Fever, chills, my spine aches. I told you it was cold and flu season. It's hide. You have to stop him before... before it's too... Sanctuary! Sanctuary! Oh no, 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 not- Ouch! <laughs> Be careful, Master. It's scary inside. Here. 
I was cold. Marshmallows always make me feel good. Want one? I've got work to do. Here, replied the butler. Indeed, we see very little of him on this side of the house. He mostly comes and goes by the laboratory. Please hurry, Master. I don't feel so good. some sort of medicine. Soon I will be the ruler of the imaginary realm. I know one of these leads to really big trouble. It's just you. Did you hear that scream? It was awful. I know. I hate castor oil. Eww, yuck! Hey, this is my room. I'm back home. No, you're not. This is my room. What did you expect? We classics are magical. <sighs> Uh oh, 450 degrees Fahrenheit. 451 and I'm ashes to ashes, dust to dust. You got to hurry, master. <laughs> oh, that's it. You need the lifesaver. Be careful, master.
Uh-oh. Looks like this plant got too much water. Care for a lifesaver? emotions of benevolence towards me, I should return them a hundredfold. For that one person, I would make peace with all men. is not good. You better have a good reason for waking me up. Otherwise, I'm going to be real cranky. Have you seen a crazed maniac running around? Glowing red eyes, bad haircut? I told you, I was sleeping. I have to find him. He's got my friend, the Page Master. You're lucky. You have friends. I have nothing. I am reviled. No one loves me. Come on, you must have one. I have no one! <gasps> Sorry. Now, what kind of maniac are you looking for? Psychopath or sociopath? No, you don't understand. I have to find Hyde. He's kidnapped the Page Master. Hyde? Hyde promised to make me look handsome. All I got to do is drink this. No, no, don't drink it! And why not? Uh, uh, it'll kill you. So, it's better than being alone, hated. If I'm handsome, people will like me. You don't have to be handsome for people to like you. Just be yourself. I'm a monster for crying out loud. I terrify people. Thanks, but I'm going the Prince Charming route. No, you'll regret it. Maybe not now, but soon and for the rest of your life. You think you can stop me? I know I can. How are you going to do that, kid? I'm 8'6", 900 pounds. emotions of benevolence towards me, I should return them a hundredfold. For that one person, I would make peace with all men. Please try this first. I'm in love. Who, who exactly am I in love with? I haven't put the pieces together yet. I knew it was too good to be true. She doesn't exist because no one could ever love me. Unless, unless you made me someone. I've never built someone a girlfriend before. Well, will you make me a match? I think I need more information. You can make me a bride, or find me a bride. So, do you want to make me a bride? Deal, but you've got to promise not to hurt anyone. Not even a fly, I promise. Dark 
darkness had no effect upon my fancy, and a churchyard was to me merely the receptacle of bodies deprived of life. Well, what are you waiting for? How on earth am I going to find a bride? Don't tell me. A personal ad. Almost. A graveyard. Here, you'll need this. I think I'll go freshen up. La -da -dee. Shall we go back to the library, Master? Sorry. You're supposed to be in bed. This is my next stop if you don't find Hyde. I just thought I'd save some time. Besides, I know all the best tunes. Okay, then. Let's get to it. He's done a catching God, and gone to me is God. Eunice Thumbrister. From a wagon she hitched a ride, hit a bump, and then she died. Florence Mistletoe loved the holidays. Here lies the body of Susan Lauder who burst while drinking seltzer powder. Called from this world to her heavenly rest, she should have waited till it effervesced. Gertrude Torsonson left behind a great body of work. Excuse me, 
your deadliness. Welcome to my nightmare. What happened, Master? Early frost. Bird your handly. Picked one too many pockets. Heady foot. She certainly was swift of. Regina Leggett, dancer. She died with her taps on. The toe bone's connected to the foot bone. The foot bone's connected to the leg bone. Let's see, carry the ankle bone. Yup, that's everything. Best friend? I don't think so. It was mutton, buzzard breath. It was a T-bone bird brain. Mutton! The forecast, cloudy, windy, and cold. I know one of these leads to really big trouble. Well, where is she? Uh, right here. She's not really finished yet. What a babe! I can't wait to see her together. Hey! 
hand me a leg, will you? Help me with this torso. Very funny. Where's the head? I did it! I did it! I found the head! I hope you like her! Wow. <laughs> She's beautiful. But how are you going to make her come alive? You're right. How do I do that? Maybe you should check the doctor's notes. that I might infuse a spark of being into the lifeless thing that lay at my feet. She's alive! Good job, Master. Hooray! I knew it! Love at first fright! Thanks for everything, short stuff! I want you to have this! Good luck, little buddy! Thanks, Frank! Thank you, Master! You saved me! Horror! You're okay! <laughs> Hold on, honey. You still have your work cut out for you. That's right, laddie! Chart a course! Home, sweet home. It looks radioactive. Must have blown a fuse. Well, good luck, honey. Baby, remember, a word is worth a thousand pictures. Don't trust all this sugar and spice stuff. Even daffodils can be treacherous. I want to see the flowers, too. Flowers? I'm allergic to flowers. Amphora! Marveled at the fleece, which glittered like the lightning of Zeus. This is great! I'm sorry. I don't believe we've been introduced. I'm Celine. I... I... Richard! My name's Richard! I'm sorry! Nothing I desire. Perhaps you'd like to answer a teensy tiny little riddle. What is the beginning of eternity, the end of time, and the start of every ending? The letter E. E stands for exit. Yes, I did it. I did it. I solved the riddle of the Sphinx. Fleece was of pure gold and put in the care of a monstrous dragon. I knew 
I should have brought my flashlight. Perhaps I could shed some light on the subject. Excuse me, great sir. I'm looking for... My treasure! You are my treasure just like that Jason kid. Who's Jason? You know, Jason. Of Jason and the Argonauts. He stole the golden fleece I was guarding. I've been depressed ever since. I don't want your treasure. I'm looking for Mr. Hyde. He's kidnapped the Page Master. That's not good. Tell you what. You get my fleece back and I'll help you find Hyde. Hyde was here? You seen him? He left this. The sword and the stone. Also known as Excalibur. I'll give it to you. For the fleece, Jill. Deal! Uh, what's a fleece? Ask Zeus. He's probably got it hidden up on Mount Olympus. It's okay. We're the same. But how could... I'm your future. Or is it your past? I always get those mixed up. In the world of imagination, there is no time. Mixed up? Mixed up? This whole thing is crazy. Of course it is. That's what makes it so much fun. Now, be careful with the Phantom Troll booth. As Jack peeped out of the oven, he saw the hen lay a golden egg. This might help me get ahead. First, I shall try to ask him to give us the Golden Fleece. This could be a good sign. I've never heard of an apple snoring before.
It had space for 50 oars and was named the Argo, after its builder Argus, the son of Aristor. It's a satyr! What beautiful music! I hope I wasn't bothering you. It's just so beautiful here, I could play for hours. Oh no, your music was very nice. I find it very soothing. Would you like me to play some more? No offense, but I can't stay. You still have a long way to go. If you don't rest, you'll get sick. Please listen. Sorry, but I can't sleep at a time like this. Do not hesitate to ask or say whatever your heart bids you. But remember that we are in a holy place where a lie would be blasphemy. Oh, goody! Customers! May I help you? Then go away! I have customers to serve! Request, you know. Want to hear us sing? Jason stole a golden ram, golden ram, golden ram. Jason stole a golden ram, it's three years old now, go. If you visit Zeus up there, Zeus up there, Zeus up there. If you visit Zeus up there, be sure and say hello. All over the world, the fleece was regarded as a priceless treasure. Care for a Troll House cookie? Thanks! Customers, may I help you? I'd like to cross the bridge. Let's see. Bright building, bridge burning. Ah, here it is. Bridge crossing. So, you want to cross my bridge? I'll just need a little info to fill out this form. What is your name? Richard Tyler. What is your quest? I seek the page master. A very noble quest. Let's see. Do you like spinach? Spinach? What's so important about spinach? It's very high in iron. Now, yes or no? It's really good. 
Really? I hate it. What about ice cream? Love it! Hate it! Bee stings. You like getting a bee sting? Love it! I can't stand it. What about soccer? Do you like soccer? Soccer is the worst. No way. I love it. Do you like homework? I hate homework. What about soccer? Do you like soccer? <laughs> Throwing house cookies? My favorite! Right this way, please. Continue your journey. Pigs. I think I remember that one. Houses. You sure know your fairy tales. I hope you remember the story about little Bo Peep. On his way, he met an old man who offered him five brightly colored beans for the cow. Customers, may I help you? Okay, you pass. That's it? What about that long list? Oh, that, uh, that's my grocery list. Have a nice day. The 
best shipbuilder in Greece, constructed a splendid ship. It had space for 50 oars. Miss, are you okay? <laughs> I've lost my sheep. <laughs> And you don't know where to find them? Oh, no, that's the strange part. I do know where to find him. Usually, I just leave him alone and, and he'll come home wagging his tail behind him. Right, I remember your rhyme. Well, this time he was stolen. Oh, will you help me? Of course I'll help you. Fantasy told me you were brave. Uh, uh, you said he was stolen. Any idea who did it? I don't know who, but I know where. <gasps> oh, it's no use. It's too dangerous. No one's ever survived the Lightning Palace. Should I ask someone else? I'll find your sheep, miss. Olympus! Gosh, it's so high. I'll never get up there. Beans. But it's a thousand feet up. Hey, where did you come from? Here and there? No, I mean beans. When you find the bean, your truth will not be hidden. Only your truth can save your friend. But what is my truth? Truth is different for each one of us. Where is the bean? Illusion is simply not seeing truth. Are you... are you the page master? Disappeared. At least I still have the bean. Hey, come back here. Please hurry, honey. There's no time to lose. Are you catching a cold? My wings are drooping. It's high. I'm losing my magic. All the books are losing their magic. You've got to find the page master. Hippocampus! Pan! Cool, a centaur! Naiads are women warriors. Oh, I dated a naiad, and she was no soldier. If I could interject, naiads are river nymphs. Butt out, nerd! Relax, Sarge. It's just a kid. It's not like he's gonna steal Neptune's golden ram. Hey, that's 
much classified information. Don't forget, Jack was a kid, and he stole us blind. Earthquake! Shh, don't ever say that. Be cool. You'll wake up Mr. High and Mighty. Now, state your business. I'm here to get the Golden Fleece. Oh, kid, you slay me. Yeah, right. First, you have to play our little game. What game? You have to settle a couple of our arguments. You get one point for every right answer. Five points and you win. That's easy. Three wrong answers and you're toast. Maybe we should try checkers instead. I've been researching your nutrition and I advise you avoid cookies at all costs. You're out of line, fish face. Cookies are an excellent reward for a job well done. Artificial colors and flavorings, preservatives, I gotta agree, they're bogus. Wrong! Look, I should know. Bacchus and Dionysus are the same guy, the god of wine. Blasphemy! I served under Bacchus and Dionysus. They're Greece's greatest generals. For what's pad is quite correct. Richard, 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 Richard! My idol is Hercules, the son of Zeus. For once he's right, Hercules' parents are Zeus and Alcemony. So wrong. Hercules' dad was Poseidon. Richard, 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 Richard! If you like books, page 56 of Frankenstein and page 123 of Jason and the Argonauts are extremely important readings. Books, words, pages, baloney, they won't help you clobber hide. Very cool reading, especially if you put the two together. Richard, 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 Richard! Moby Dick is a cetacean, so we should protect him no matter what. I don't care what he is. Moby is a ravenous, limb-chewing demon of the deep. He means no harm. Whales are highly intelligent, peaceful beings. Richard, 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 Richard! The best way to deal with an enemy is to start with a good clobbering. I agree, this is a very intelligently thought out insight. Don't even listen to these dolts. Use your brains, not your fists. Richard, 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 Richard! For he's a jolly good fellow, for he's a jolly good fellow. Neptune's trident! It's gold! 
gold. Its fleece is gold. I found the golden fleece. I should have brought my flashlight. Perhaps I could shed some light on the subject. Mr. Dragon, here's your fleece back. Now where did Hyde take the Page Master? That's not a fleece. It's a sweater with four legs. for the well-dressed dragon about town is... Fleeces! I'm sorry, but there's been a change of plan. Uh-oh, this is so not good. In fact, this is mega not good. If you're looking for Excalibur, I ate it. What? What about our deal? I lied. No, 
No, you listen to me. Because of you, I've been made a slave by pirates, eaten by a fire-breathing dragon, tossed, squashed, shocked, shredded, and changed into all kinds of silly animals. Well, enough's enough. You're one book that's overdue to be shelved. for crying out loud. I terrify people. Yawn, dog master, he let you pass free of charge. <laughs> you are so brave. Bananas, I love bananas. Come back here, you fight like a paperback. You still have a long way to go. No, this can't wait. We need your help. It's all up to you, honey. You sure know your fairy tales. You prevailed over you. Where's your sunscreen? For crying out loud, this is the desert. You could throw an egg out here. Hey, hand me a leg, will you? What a babe! Hi. Hi. Sanctuary, sanctuary. If we book die, Dreams, no more imagination, no more anything. Fifteen men on a dead man's chest. Yo ho ho, and a bottle of rum. Remember your truth. Troll house cook. 